Hello everyone. In this video, I'm going to discuss the solution to example 8 on buoyancy. So this is example 8. An iceberg having a specific gravity of 0.92 floats in, sea, in salt water having a specific gravity of 1.03. If the volume of ice above the surface is 700 cubic meters, what is the total volume of the iceberg? And what is the weight of the ice that is submerged? So let's have the figure. So this is the situation above the sea water's salt water surface is 700 cubic meters. Therefore, the volume that is displaced or submerged is total volume of iceberg minus 700. So since weight equals buoyant force, then let's use this equation to solve for the total volume of the ice. So weight equals buoyant force, where the weight is specific gravity of the iceberg times gamma specific weight of water times total volume of the ice while buoyant force is specific gravity of seawater salt water times specific weight of water times volume displaced which is v minus 700 so 0.92 gamma of water total volume equals uh, 1.0 t gamma of water times volume displaced V minus 700. So canceling out specific weight of water, so 0.92 V equals 1.03 quantity V minus 700, leaving V as the only unknown here. Solving for V to four significant figures, it is equal to 6,555 cubic meters. So in the second part, what is the weight of the ice that is submerged? The weight of the ice that is submerged is just the weight of this portion of the ice. So it is equal to specific weight of the ice, 0.92 times 9.81 times volume that is submerged, which is quantity V minus 700. So weight of the ice that is submerged is specific gravity of the ice, gamma of water times volume that is submerged or displaced. So 0.92 times 9.81 times quantity 6555 minus 700. So the weight of the ice that is submerged is 5. 52,843 kilonewtons. So that's it for this problem.